Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have been accused of using ideas posted on their Artool platform by the public to inspire their new work by royal watchers. Meghan and Harry set up their platform Artool after leaving the royal fold last year, and have unrolled its three branches. A podcast series Artool Audio with Spotify. A new production company Artool Productions which has a deal with Netflix. And a philanthropic branch, Artool Foundation. While the couple were praised for finding financial independence so soon after leaving the firm through their new lucrative deals, the Sussexes are yet to produce much content with a streaming giant. They did release a holiday special in December for Artual Audio, but have not published any podcast episodes since. They have also announced their first production with Netflix, a docuseries called Heart of Invictus which will follow competitors for the Invictus Games, founded by Harry, as they train for next year's tournament. But the two have not announced any other ongoing productions, and recently announced they were going to be taking a break from working life until the autumn. The Sussexes team behind Archul are still active on their behalf, however, and recently posted on the website calling for more interactions from the public and for their fans to share their personal stories of compassion. The post reads, to us, compassion means more than the dictionary definition. It means listening with open ears to the suffering and celebrations of communities and people beyond ourselves. It means taking the time to understand their perspectives, experiences and needs based on what they say, rather than assuming what they need. It added, compassion is at the core of everything we do. We hope you'll join us in building a better world, one act of compassion at a time. The website has a button below this post which encourages the public to share your story for a chance to be featured by explaining your own act of compassion. This post came a month after they first made such an appeal to the public, leaving some royal fans scratching their heads. Twitter account at UkeRoyalT also questioned why the Sussexes would be seeking such information from the public with their announcement. The account asked, why do people think Artuel would ask for submissions if it wasn't to use them in projects to read them? I think the real story is that they are asking again because they didn't get enough usable submissions for the content platform they originally wanted them for. The tweet quickly gathered almost 400 likes last week. It's not clear if that you royalty means the couple were looking for ideas for their podcast series, Artual Audio, Artual Productions, or their charitable platform in general. Either way, this is not the first time the couple have been subject to claims they were trying to harvest ideas from the public. Earlier this month, private I claimed, the Artual terms and conditions make it clear that anyone sharing a story signs over an irrevocable, royalty-free, fully paid up, in perpetuity, worldwide, assignable license to public, broadcast, and use, in any media now known, or hereafter develop not merely to the Sussex's charitable foundation but also to their limited liability company, Artual LLC, Artual Productions and Artual Audio. It added, lest there be any doubt, the non-negotiable contract specifies film, video and publication. Among the many uses the royal couple can make of people's material. Many also believe the new post on Artuel included a subtle dig at the royal family after advising the public to listen with open ears. During their bombshell Oprah Winfrey interview back in March, Meghan claimed she felt ignored when trying to voice her struggles with her new royal life. Harry also said that he would not have told the royal family Meghan needed assistance as that's just not a conversation that would be had. The Duke of Sussex also went on to accuse the royals of total neglect in his series on mental health on Apple TV, The Me You Can't See.